Welcome back to our channel, where we explore fascinating topics and debunk common myths. Today, we have a particularly interesting topic to discuss, the 5 second rule. Is it truly safe to eat food after it has been dropped on the floor? Let's find out! We've all been there, you drop a tasty snack on the floor, and the temptation to pick it up and eat it arises. But is it really safe? The 5 second rule suggests that if you pick up your food within 5 seconds of it touching the floor, it's still safe to eat. But is there any truth behind this rule, or is it just a myth? Let's dig deeper! The 5 second rule is based on the idea that bacteria and germs need time to transfer from the floor to your food. It assumes that if you grab your food quickly, it won't have enough time to become contaminated. However, is this really the case? Scientific studies have shown that the 5 second rule is more of a myth than a reality. Bacteria and germs can transfer to your food almost instantaneously upon contact with a contaminated surface. Plus, it's important to note that not all surfaces are created equal when it comes to bacteria levels. The floor of a public restroom, for example, may have more germs than your kitchen counter. Let's talk about the potential risks of eating food that has touched the floor. Many harmful bacteria, such as E. coli and Salmonella, can cause foodborne illnesses. These bacteria can survive on surfaces for extended periods, even after cleaning. By consuming contaminated food, you could put yourself at risk of getting sick. While the 5-second rule may not hold up under scientific scrutiny, there are a few factors to consider. Firstly, the type of food matters. A dry, solid item like a cracker is likely to pick up fewer bacteria than a moist or sticky food. Secondly, the cleanliness of the surface plays a role. A clean kitchen floor will have fewer bacteria compared to a dirty, high-traffic area. Instead of relying on the 5-second rule, it's crucial to focus on personal hygiene. Washing your hands before handling food and maintaining a clean kitchen environment are key in preventing foodborne illnesses. It's always better to be safe than sorry when it comes to your health. So, in conclusion, it's best to avoid relying on the 5-second rule. While it may seem tempting to pick up that dropped cookie, the risks of contamination outweigh the benefits. By practicing good hygiene and maintaining a clean environment, you can greatly reduce the chances of falling ill from contaminated food. That's it for today's video. We hope you found this exploration of the 5 second rule informative and thought provoking. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more myth busting content. Stay curious, and we'll see you next time.